uh, young uh, rival of Magnus of uh, Prague. I played uh, him Iron Flat Open a couple of years ago, several years ago, and uh, I described like making the port rating before the game that in his chess education, one thing is missed. He's not playing any kind of dynamical chess. He ah. tries to avoid any kind of messy positions. He's very, very classical educated. And I think this game would depend on the point uh, if Magnus will manage to create kind of mess on board or uh, uh, Brack will slowly squeeze from maybe slightly worse position to kind of style he's used to play. Mm. Uh, the four, yeah, I think Magnus' choice of E3 move, avoiding of all kind of scimitarish typical openings, trading half of the pieces, uh, telling the same. So he wants to get as more pieces as possible, as more uh, unstable structure as possible. We clearly will see or hanging pulls or isolated pawn uh, pretty soon. So uh, now all depends on uh, uh, Magnus' choice and uh, Prague's style of position or not. Because some types of chess it's not easy to play for Prague. Yeah, I think you've nailed it there. Actually, when I lost to Prague when uh, when he was 12, it, I was actually better for most of the game. I turned down a few draws, but it wasn't endgame. Very technical, and he was great there using his classical education. But I played him recently last year, and I I actively tried to make it more dynamic, and he was very very uncomfortable. And actually, that game I was a move or two away from winning. So yeah, I think he's definitely still has some weaknesses, uh, which he will uh, paper over over the next few years. And uh, meanwhile, Mac is trying to keep as many pieces on the board in order to head for those dynamic. So a couple of trades so far, this is still quite a well-known position. And uh, the usual move here is knight takes pawn in the center just to ensure black has an isolated pawn, something a bit long-term. But Magnus was about to say, I just have a feeling he was going to recapture it with his own pawn. And this is exactly the same pawn structure we saw earlier today between Kosteniuk and Magnus. But their colors were reversed. And uh, this time, though, white is slightly more active uh, than Kosteniuk was in that yeah, situation. I expect... Uh, Deliver a bishop on g5, knight on e5. Magnus wants to be on the pressing side. He wants to go more central and uh, clearly he wants to use the advantage of the first move. So this is the symmetry, but uh, compared to the game versus Kostinuk, uh, he didn't spoil a single tempo in the position. Oh. And uh, you were talking about symmetry there, and I was going to say the top move is actually to copy white. And uh, you can see Pragnanda, he knows his stuff and he's following the suit. Yeah, everything is symmetrical pretty much apart uh, apart from the placement of a couple of bishops. So uh, yeah, Magnus meanwhile taking control of the only, well, one of the only open lines in the position. And will Pragnananda copy, try and trade a set of rooks off on this open file? Or will he bring his Lysbird bishop out?
Struggling to even find a defence here, Full White. And Magnus clearly struggling as well. Um, as you mentioned, your banker, the big, big threat in the position is the bank just to offer some trades or um, just to create some safety. But no, okay, Magnus does try and create that air for his king. But as you guys mentioned, the only escape square for that white king is up the board on a light square. 8.5 on the bar. Checkmate is just coming. What happens after Black brings the queen down to the first rank on the E1 square? It's just. I mean, it's wow. just checkmate coming. Just game over. It's just 16 game over. year old Prognanandi, the youngest player in the tournament against the world champion. This could be a little piece of history in the making. I think we've cursed Magnus. We didn't follow him today, and then he won all his games as soon as we followed yeah, him. Right. He's about we, to lose. we followed him with Kostelnik. Ah, uh, true, true. But he's about to lose a sensational game now. And there we go. White's queen trying to cover the light squares. That's quite clever. Uh, trying to stop the black bishop from joining the action, trapping the white king. But if yeah, but Magnus losing the, the piece after knight g3, queen e5, and potential bishop e5 check. He's, he's just. That's just game like, over. Like, like the simplest uh, way first, you have to calculate. 40 seconds. Sure. Yeah, so yeah. maybe there are other moves as well, but Black's knight going and capturing the white bishop wins on the spot. Um, as you have getting points out there, there are some deadly checks. White's king is just uh, in too much peril. Black could even maybe just push the pawn forward. That would be uh, <laughs> tempting as well. But knight yep. takes bishop and look at Magnus. He's realized he's about to lose. At minimum, he's going to lose a knight. Checkmate might be coming as well. No way to save this game. Okay, he takes a pawn. And uh, yeah, Black has plenty of ways to win this now. You can just move the knight, you can give a check, you can bring the knight back uh, to where it came from. Any, any, any square for any a knight square. works. Yeah. Yeah. And White's King only has one safe square now. You have to go up the board. That is not going to be safe. Wow, what a crazy moment, you guys. 16-year-old about to beat Magnus Carlsen. Yeah, and uh, he's just trying to cling on. Mm -hmm. Magnus has literally got his fingernails now, uh, just clinging onto that cliff edge. Yep. But, oh, wow, what a move. That cuts the coordination between White's queen and the second rank. And is Magnus about to resign? Is he going to throw in the towel? White's knight now hit by the black queen. And if it moves, it's a deadly check in the corner. It's just game over. Yeah, game over. Wow, has he ever won before Pragnananda against Magnus Carlsen in any official game? I don't think so. I don't think no, so. I don't think so. It's a historical moment and it's here. Magnus Carlsen, the world champion, loses to 16-year-old 